hello everyone welcome back to our channel good morning good afternoon good evening i greet you all according to your time and locations you'll be watching this video yes my dear viewers i am back again with another update so guys i have a video here i would like we all to watch but before then if you're meeting my channel for the very first time you're highly welcome please kindly do well to like share and subscribe leave your thought on the comment section and let us know what you think about this video and I will see you towards the end. Two weeks have been restrained by the Federal Capital Territory High Court. After Tuesday's drama at the Appeal Court, Abure resumed today, declaring himself the authentic chairman of the party. Arise correspondent China Zesamo reports. As the Labour Party's presidential candidate, Peter Obi continues to battle the All Progressives Congress in the election tribunal. Two factional chairmen, Lamidia Papa and Julius Abure, are on each other's throat on who is the authentic chairman of the troubled party. On Thursday, Julius Abure resumed at the party's national secretariat, despite a court order that restrains him from parading himself as the chairman of the party. He explains the reason for his action. We have also filed our appellant's brief of arguments, which has been served on the courts, on the trial courts. By necessary implication, the FCT High Court in Maitama ceases to have jurisdiction over the matter, having successfully filed our notice of, uh, of appeal, transmitted records, and also filed a motion for stay of proceedings in the FCT High Court. Having appealed and filed a motion of stay and all other processes and since the lower court is now seized with jurisdiction on, on the matter, I and my colleagues, earlier restrained by the FCT High Court, have now assumed our constitutional duty as national officers. Abure and his team debunked different allegations made by Lamidi Apapa, including bribery surgery and violence. What are we talking about regionalization or, 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 or religious uh, aspect of this? These guys are trying to work on the sentiment of Nigeria to cause havoc. They have already done enough and we want to call to on all Nigerians to, to for well, forget about them because they are working for their famous. Their, their In another part of the city, the Apapa faction also addressed journalists and the drama of the Court of Appeal. They alleged threats to life by the Aburi faction while insisting that they will appear in court again, despite the threats. We have received threats from the following people. Uh, Kennedy Anotu, I, I said that his number in that press conference. Prince Jude AJK, Honorable Imeje Ikeshuku, and one of The threats center around them wanting not to come to court tomorrow, else we'll be killed. So we are only alerting the threat general police, because we are going to attend that court. Every one of you saw what happened there yesterday. We are going to attend that court. They can carry on, they can carry out their plan to assassinate us. Because we know that Obi himself is supposed to conduct himself in a civil manner. When you are in a party and you don't want to respect the leadership, just like as he did in PDP, he did that in ABDA, and now he's doing in Labour Party. When you don't want to respect the constitutional authority, we on our part, we will also not you know, give you that respect. For the Labour Party, its battle lies both in court and outside court. With both factions refusing to sheath their sword, it seems the party is in for a long period of crisis, which observers say may affect its fortunes at the different election tribunals and subsequent elections. Chinaza Samuel, Arise News. Well, the faction and national secretary Uma Farouk joins us now to uh, speak more on this. Good to see you and thanks for your time. We saw you in that report. Uh, what uh, really uh, many Nigerians will be asking at this point in time, we're trying to see some kind of precedence in, in, in times past in, in Nigeria when uh, the court ruled that Adam Zoshomala should vacate office as the national chairman of the APC, the party uh, abided by that decision. The same when the court also ruled that Ayu, uh, who was the PDP chairman at that point in time, should leave, immediately uh, was secondus. Uh, the same we have seen. But now the court has ruled that Abura should stop parading himself as uh, national chairman. Uh, your, yourself and a few others, uh, plus uh, your uh, presidential candidate, uh, have refused to obey the court order. So let us in on why this is. 
Well, um, thank you very much, Sleman. Um, first of all, for the purpose of record, I am the substantive national secretary of the Labour Party, not a factional. There is no faction in Labour Party. There are only renegades that have come to, you know, to, to, to cause chaos. They have been sponsored to come and create havoc in the Labour Party. And that is why what happening is happening now. But you can see how it is metamorphosis. Their intent is being, you know, they are betraying themselves. They are revealing their intents now. They always want to cause crisis. Um, what happened up initial was some group of people that are unknown to Labour Party came on the media and alleged to have suspended the national secretary and the national chairman of the party. The Azum or the alleged they have come from their world. When we checked the database of our party, we didn't see them, we didn't see their name, we didn't even see them at membership card. They did not exist at all, at all. And in the party constitution, our constitution, the constitution of the Labour Party, is not like that of the APC or the PDP, where a lower uh, chapter of the party can suspend an officer. The only person that can suspend a national officer is the National Executive Council of the, uh, of the party. Next, the local government chapter the word chapter can only discipline their respective uh, uh, chapters. This guy just came and assumed that they have suspended us. That is the first false allegation against our national chairman and us. Then they quickly, when they know that, <coughs> that allegation of suspension of the national chairman will not fly. So they quickly went and get a certified true copy of a police investigation report. The police in this investigation report, the, somebody alleged that his name was purged, purportedly purged, to replace him as the gubernatorial candidate of Oibonyi State. If you are alleging that somebody, your name is forged. The first thing is a court of competent jurisdiction will have to find out. Police, quite all right, they should do their investigation. If they finish their investigation, they should submit it to you, the court. You, you know, then the to, court I, I to, I will you, assume. I have to give you such time to actually uh, explain, but again, yes. we still have not been able to come to the question I asked, uh, talking about the court. Uh, that has asked that Julius Aburi vacate as the chairman of your party. And now you're talking about your party uh, at the local level. So uh, speak to us uh, as, an, uh, as a party man. Shouldn't you obey a court? We have obeyed the court. We have in the same day, yes. on the same time, we had Aburi when Aburi was alleged to have been suspended, he got a restraining order for the party and any official of the party to act or to suspend him. So now we have two judgments from court of coordinate jurisdiction. One court from Benin has uh, ruled that Abure should not be suspended and remains the substantive national chairman of the party. Then another judgment came from Abuja High Court that Abure should stop parading himself and four others, including myself, that we should stop parading ourselves. Since then, we used to say, what is parading? We are not going for any parade or whatever. The court did not say Abure should not function as a party man. And if at all he has three difficulties, 
I, as the national secretary, I have two duties. Well, the court so has those duties can continue to do their work. Says, uh, you pending the hearing of this You're, you're uh, not court. national chairman. Uh, that, that's what the court says in explicit terms, that he should stop raiding himself. But uh, the, the thing here, uh, uh, before, uh, uh, Olija, before you come in quickly, uh, more importantly, we've seen uh, Lamidia Papa speak. And uh, you see that um, when he speaks, uh, he seems to have... Uh, uh, you know, such regards for uh, your Labour Party presidential candidate uh, because he said uh, they've been uh, a few times together. So, uh, why is your candidate, presidential candidate, not using this cloud uh, to see how these two factions?